Hello, everyone. And after a, about a two-hour time it took me to work with somebody, I think we finally have it figured out how to get you guys on Game Pass to get your mods working. Now, let me first start off with Banderlord Software Extender, the LSE mod. I'm not 100% certain that all of you need this. I think you do, but as I am not a Game Pass player, I'm not 100% certain. So I will leave a link in the description to this because I think this is what is needed by you to be able to launch the game. So just in case that it is needed. So let me get you what exactly the problem is. Inside Bannerlord, in your modules directory, you have your mods, but they don't want to work. When you load it up, it says it can't find the DLL file. So after about two hours of searching, I finally came across this post from Reddit. And this is what I want to go ahead and highlight. This is what the problem is. When you go into your modules folder, you will see wind shipping client. But because you are using Game Pass, you need to change the name of that folder. I will put the name of this in the description so that way you can easily just copy and paste it. So all you need to do is go into your modules folder and every time you download a mod, go into it, go into the bin folder, and here you will see the wind shipping client. All you need to do is rename it to the one that we just had. Now your mods will work. So you just need to rename that for every single one of the mods that you want to run. So go into your modules folder, go into the mod, go into the bin folder, and rename the shipping client to gaming.desktop x64. Like I said, I will leave that in the description. I will leave a link to the Reddit post in the description so you guys can go ahead and read it. But that should fix the problem if you ever see missing DLL when you try to load it. As I said, I'm not a console player, so I'm not 100% certain on the BLSE mod if you need it or not. But hopefully this helps you out. I got somebody else to get it to work by doing this. And hopefully this will cure your problem. And you can have fun modding your game. Until next time, take care. And thanks for watching.